Here's one simple trick that can help you understand the way hacking tools work. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. It's as simple as understanding that almost every command line hacking tool has switches. You enter the tool name, a hyphen, and then the letter. The hyphen plus letter is called a switch. Think of it as an on-off switch for lights. Flipping the switch will perform an action, like turning on the lights, for example. You enter the tool's name and provide a list of switches, essentially telling the tool what to turn on and what to keep off. And this could be something as simple as what target to scan or what payload to use or where to store the output and in what format. You providing the switches is what helps the tool to do exactly what's needed. You can adjust speed, output format, types of tests, or even evasion tactics among many other options. And all you're really doing with any tool is directing the actions that it can take. Like a race car driver, the switches are a combination of the accelerator, brake, clutch, and the gear shifter. You're controlling where the car goes, at what speed, to what destination, and how efficient is the route that you take. So in short, learn how to use the tools the same way you'd learn how to drive. And know that in most cases, it's just a bunch of switches that you can use to hack ethically by customizing the actions that you take. Bottom line, don't let the command line tools overwhelm you or confuse you and use those switches wisely. Thanks for watching.